right, how are you doing? So here I am, Loch Maria Cure. This is a huge, and huge probably doesn't do service, gigantic broken monolith. At one point it was thought to be 20 meters tall and it's broken into four massive stones. I mean massive, massive. And thought to have weighed around 300 tons, just shy 300 tons, which to put that into perspective is probably something like three Boeing 747s. So this is this is a huge, this is a you know this is a bad boy, this monolith. Whether it was uh, broken uh, by natural causes, whether it will be able, by a earthquake or, or lightning, we don't know or it was broken intentionally i don't know that either but being here it, you know it's absolutely massive i mean just trying to imagine the, the size of this monolith when it was in its heyday it's thought to date from, from 4500 bc so we're talking at least 6000 to 7000 years old and you know 7000 years ago so I'm not entirely sure where the stones come from. I think most of the stone in Karnak is, is fairly local. But how did the ancients, uh, how did they erect this? How, how, did they, how did they put it together? It makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. Um, and what was going on? What was its, what was its function? You know, we are about 15-20 um, minutes drive from the Karnak alignment, so is this connected to the, the alignments itself? Maybe it's a, an extension of the, of the alignment site to, I don't know, I always, I always think these sites are related to energy. So is it a, an extension of the site to, I don't know, extend the energy across the land? Who knows? But it's super impressive. It's, it's quite something. the more I know that we know nothing. I had to think about that, about our ancient past. None of it makes absolutely no sense. And my wife thinks I'm a wee bit mad, but it just makes me think, why isn't everybody talking about this? You know what I mean? Why isn't everybody curious or asking the questions as to what was going on in the past? Because when you see this stuff, when you're there firsthand, you're touching it and feeling it and experiencing it, then it just blows your mind, you know. So there we go, I hope you enjoyed that wee video of a not so wee, incredible sight, massive, big monolith behind us. You know, what was going on, there's clearly a very sacred site and the ancients clearly went to a lot of effort here. But why? Have you been here? Tell us what you think. And as I said, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Leave us a comment. And if you can subscribe to Rep Nature as well, that'd be amazing. All right, nice one. Cheers.